Hello everyone, Heather Kane here with Project Light It Up and I am very close to Detroit, Michigan. Um, I'm actually in Sterling Heights today with uh, a new old friend, old new friend, <laughs> yeah. um, Patty Lopez. And so I wanted to give her the opportunity to introduce herself, tell uh, you a little bit about her, what she does, but she honestly, quick promo, she's a powerhouse, right? She's one of the few women um, here in the Detroit-based area that is, um, you know, a women's own defense manufacturer, contractor, um, obviously with the U.S. government. Uh, and so with that, I want to introduce Patty. Patty? Hi, good afternoon, everybody. I am Patty Lopez, as she said, and I'm the president of Rosalie Technologies. We offer engineering services and manufactured products for the U.S. government. We've been in business about three years, and uh, it's been a lot of fun. Yeah. So we just finished our interview, and what we talked a lot about is, you know, the importance of in any industry when you're breaking in, you're starting your own new business, uh, really knowing people, right, and seeking out advice and being a good listener and letting people know that, you know, you're willing to do what others will not, and you're willing to travel that road less traveled. And uh, Patty has definitely done it, and this is a, a full-blown uh, family operation here. Mm -hmm. um, you own the organization in conjunction with your sister and your father, right? Right? That's correct. Yeah. So, yeah. so it's so such an interesting opportunity to hear from someone who is actively in it every single day with their loved ones. They're making um, a very strong go of it, and they're in you know basically they're a minority effectively in a in, in a particular field, um, which obviously can be uh, an asset too as far as perspective. So, with that, definitely uh, take a look at the URL here. Thank you very much, Gabriel. Um, and connect with her, right? Because she's a mover, she's a shaker, she's one of our firewalkers, and uh, she's one of those that we interviewed who's moving it um, on the ground here um, in Michigan. So have a good day, everybody. Take care, and thank you so much for tuning in.